The steel makers and also the recyclers they are all passionate about this project. Everybody knows we have to keep increasing the use in the steel scrap in the UK steel manufacturing. When you increase the scrap you use, you can significantly reduce the carbon dioxide emission and also energy consumption. For example, the iron ore and the coking coal based uh, steel manufacturing process normally it generates about 2 ton carbon dioxide per ton liquid steel. But if it's a scrap based electric arc furnace uh, manufacturing steel manufacturing process, the carbon dioxide could be as low as 0.1 ton carbon dioxide equivalent per ton steel. We talk about using renewable electricity and we need to use some uh, renewable or carbon neutral carbon in certain process. So you can see the significant benefit in reducing the carbon dioxide reduction. That's actually one of the major decarbonization route. That's the, why the industry is so passionate about that. If we can increase the tolerance of the residue elements in steel manufacturing without changing the steel properties, that means the steel industry can use cheaper because uh, the high uh, residue elements, that kind of steel scrap to make steel, that will bring the significant economic benefit to them from the raw materials to steel making and to the users, the customers and the cyclers and then back to the steel maker. We actually look at the different sports and to look at okay, what technology we should develop, we should implement to improve the quality of the steel scrap, uh, manage the uh, upcycling, not downcycling, not just uh, use the steel scrap to make some cheap steel. That's not uh, we are looking for. We are looking for to use the steel scrap to make high quality steels.